Well, the basics like Greg and today we're actually. So this is where I normally review things like from this capitated minifigure with Obi Wan with his head or something like that. But today we're actually going to the reviewing area. So this is my desk. This de the, not my desk, but this is the desk that I put a lot of stuff on, like a bunch of like the computer. Bunch of Legos or Lego minifigures and builds because I can't not really say Legos and, and Lizard. My how to make minifigures, EPO, SD cards, a Hufflepuff pop socket that is like not stick, not sticking anymore. This thing I reviewed, which I reviewed the first part of this review in upside down, which is always great. And yeah, some happy. Hot Wheels, not Happy Meal stuff, and just other random stuff onto my on my desk. Then here is where the minifig checklists are in my Harry Potter checklist. The new Nikitty minifigures 18, Batman series one, Batman series two, and Ninjago. Some paintings I made. A um, thing, some other things, some Harry Potter thing. My hair, my Hagrid Funko Pop. Which I might review if I want to. Anyway, this is where all the Lego pieces are and mini and just Lego pieces are kept. These are all the most mini take pieces. Now the snitch. And then below this are like pieces, and then more pieces, and then more pieces. I don't really organize because this is like so many fake pieces that I've worked with pieces bin. This is like the big pieces bin. This is another big pieces bin. Oh, here's the where that where that went. And then my booklets. I'm pretty sure it's the heaviest one. And on the top of this we have my the set, my kind of destroyed set of the um Museum. When the museums are shut. Top motion I made. Uh, then just a bunch of Lego minifigures. And Hagrid. And Dickley, here's my where I keep my collectible. It's on the stairs. I don't want Lego pieces on the stairs because that would hurt. But then, we have my collectible. We have all my collectible minifig. We have collectible minifigs. So we have the full series of Harry Potter. I reviewed that. And we have the series 18. Most of the ones I could find. And yeah, so here is the Star Wars display on top of this yellow bookshelf. And yeah, it's not really like, like, like all the displays that are not like my main shelf display, which we'll get into, it are kind of messed up, are kind of messed up a little bit. So yeah, it's the only thing to keep in mind. But so far, like into the general sense, like Yoda's hut, Luke's hut. This gave information the moss, the moss, the kind of moss canard castle. And here's my Lego city, which you can see it's like messed up. There's a bunch of like Lego mini figures everywhere and like uni city and stuff. But until like the general, like there's the three frescoes, there's like the house, and then like my custom thing, and then the bridge, and then the daily bugle set, which I reviewed the daily bugle and that. that. And there's like a bunch like a non Lego football thing and stuff. And yeah, there's a bunch of minifigs, so I want to clean this up at one point. But let me have this couch in front of my Lego today. And then here is where the video game stuff is. Hi, guys. Hello. Hi, butt cheeks. Um. Butthole! Butthole! Then we have all the video games like Lego Harry Potter. Oh, the okay. Hi guys. Hello, that's my brother. So here is the PS3, which we don't use. And then this is Jake's Nintendo you know, Switch case. Then there's two PlayStation 3 controllers, a football helmet, Chewbacca, uh, um, a Han Solo, um, Indiana Jones, a Patriot Xbox controller. A blanket for some reason just sitting there. 
you switch dock, and I don't know where, I, where they actually put the actual switch. The switch is in, is in our dad's office. Then the brick heads, all the beautiful little brick heads. Harry, Hedwig, Hermione, Ron, Dumbledore, Daddy. Luke, Yoda, Chewie, Be um, Belle, Beast, and Lloyd. There's more, like, Switch. Them, like, the Switch and stuff. Like, the Switch and Xbox One games. My the Skylanders, and then, like, Skylander Dimension stuff, Portal. It's basically just another show. And then we, on the top of the entertainment zone, just a bunch of stuff. But anyway, if we move this couch a little bit, just a little bit, so we can actually get in. We have my main display of Lego. So let's start down here, because this is the, because this isn't the one that, like, every, this is, like, we'll do the most interesting stuff last, and then start. Cool. Right here, guys. Yes, very cool. Then we have the Minecraft. Hey, free time. You can't use that video anymore. So we have the Minecraft world right here, which is very cool. Like the Nether railway, like the Nether area, the snowy area, this like kind of farmy area, and the mushroom place, and the cave. It's pretty nice. This is something that used to be part of the Hogwarts, but now it's not. not. Then we move on to and a, um, a non-Lego Minecraft wolf. And then we have the... We tr go from Minecraft world to Batman world, which has a lot of the Batman stuff. Like, the Batcave is the main centerpiece of this. Like, the Batboat. There's a little rabbit. You did this, but never uploaded it. So, yeah. But, yeah, that's kind of sort of the bottom. So, I'm not going to move on to my favorite shelf. Which is the Harry Potter shelf. My favorite theme. So we have all my Harry Potter related things that are Lego. So we have Hagrid's hut right here. Very nice. Hag the my favorite Lego set ever, the original 2010 Hogwarts castle with like well, with the mini figs around it. Then the new Hogwarts Great Hall. And the new Hogwarts Whomping Willow. With the Whomping Willow. And then the Quidditch mat to complete the full Look in the ergo glare is tucked in here with the two mini figs. That's it. Anyway. Also, just so you know, right there is like um, a bin of the stuff I got for Christmas and then some Lego boxes. So, that is the end of this video of my room tour. What did they catch? A bunch of board games up there. Hi, guys. Okay, it's the end of the video. Bye. I'm just sure.